everybody okay. else here. Hi, nice to see you again. Quickly, is there anything you want to say to Utah because they're watching? Oh right man, now. just thanks for your support, you guys. Ah, oh, you're awesome, and I can't wait to go back and see everyone. It's so cool. We love David and Brooke. We're so happy to have you here. How do you yes. feel? You made the top 12. Oh, gosh. You know, it's pretty amazing. It's, you know, it's like a weird dream, a really good weird dream. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm so excited to be here. I'm very grateful. Thank you to voters, you guys. I just, you know, it's a, it's, you know, they help us get here Certainly. in a big way, in a big and, way. And when I saw you, uh, you know, they always are showing your, your face when they're making the announcement of whether or not you've made it. And genuinely, you looked nervous. I but, was, but yeah. But really, to not make it into the top 12, I think so many people thought you would. So, um, Well, you know, I we're in a bubble, so we don't, you know, a lot of people, I guess, talk about what's going on, but I don't really know, you know, so I just, um, I'm really focused on um, my songs and making them work and connecting with uh, the people. So, you know, but everyone's so talented that you just don't know where you're going to end up. Yeah. I mean, you hope for the best, but you just don't know. Okay. So. Now, you're from Murray, Utah. You have family in Utah. Yes. Talk about these Utah connections and what they mean to you personally. Um, well, my cousin Emily, she just had a baby in Logan. So, hi, Emily and baby Grace. Um, yeah, my just cousins in Logan and friends in Utah and my husband went to school in Provo so you know we have a lot of um, family and friends over in that direction and David I, your high school principal actually told me to tell you he's pulling for you Scott Bushnell oh, yeah. and um, people at Murray High how do you feel about that apparently they're making announcements during the game too and oh, vote for David gosh. <laughs> that's so weird because it's just like you go there being a student with just with everyone else like hey yeah, go to school and stuff it's so weird it's so cool to know that people at your school, everyone's supporting you. It's just awesome. What about your voice coach? He's been in on our show on Good Day Utah. Is he helpful? How do you pick your songs? Um, well, my, my coach helps me a lot with just being able to be flexible with my voice, helps keep it in shape more, and he's awesome. He just helps me with those high, like, just with my range and stuff like that, keeping my voice loose. He's great. And Brooke, it's working. I, it's, it's working. It is working. It's working for David. I talked to your husband tonight. I actually you saw did. him before you awesome. got here. Yeah, he was really cute. Yeah, and he yeah, said he cute. was just as nervous as you were probably. Is yeah. it nice though that he's so close? You have that support system. Uh, I'm very fortunate that, that he is there. I was saying it's nice. He comes and picks up my laundry, takes it home, and does it and folds it and brings it back. He's a sweetheart. He does laundry. That's he, a catch. Uh, I mean, seriously. Come on. No, um, it's it's really great. It's a blessing to, to have him around. Okay, one more quick, quick, quick sure. question. What does your strategy change from here on out at all? Mm -hmm. Go ahead. David. Just keep being yourself. You know, just keep doing what you would normally do. What makes you you? A hundred percent. That's it. You know, be you. Do nothing less. And it, it's um, just stay really true to who you are. That's the key here. And, just hope that you pick the songs that resonate with the voters. Thank you guys so much. Thank Congratulations. You. Go relax a little bit if you can. I know you've got others to talk to, but um, thank you. Way to go. Thank you. Thanks, you thanks, guys. That's my dad over there. And that's your dad. My dad in the back. <laughs> Hi, dad. Right. <laughs> All right. Thanks, guys. Hope. What a couple of great contestants, aren't they? It's kind of fun to have two people from Utah, David Archuleta, obviously from Murray, and Brooke with her family ties. Her husband went to BYU. Anyway, really solid, grounded, very talented people. I'm sure they'll do well in this competition, but tonight they can relax a little bit. They've been under so much pressure for four weeks. They can enjoy tonight, and then it's back to work tomorrow. And oh. Carrie, I, if you're like me, you just want to take David and put his head on your windshield and squish him. Oh no, that was Paula Abdul who wanted to that do was that. Paula, yeah. yeah. We just well, want to give him a big buddy? hug. He is awfully darling. Um, he is darling. In fact, um, today in USA Today, in the life section, there was an interview with Jordan Sparks, last year's Idol winner, and she said the exact same thing. She apparently is following Idol, and she picked her choices, and David Archuleta was one of them, and she pretty much said the same thing as Paula, that she just wanted to hug the guy. You do, and he's just got such good energy, and he's so smiling. All right, we'll see what happens. Carrie, great job in L.A. Thanks, Hope.